Es ist Sparta! Hello everybody and welcome back to World of Tanks. My name is Spartan Elite 43 and tonight we are going to have a little bit of fun. I've got a double feature for you on this Friday and we are in the Sexton 1 Tier 3 American Premium Artillery piece. Um, the first video, I'm not going to lie, we got bottom tier. So we're going to make the most of it, which generally in a Sexton means you're going to nickel and dime people, but we're going to try. We've got enemies incoming. And you know, Better that's take all we can do. Anytime you're bottom Let's here, go. you got to give it a shot. Now, you're going to notice me move very far forward really early. And this is going to be for basically a couple reasons. One, I want to be closer than the other arty so that my shells hit first. I also want to be closer because my shells don't go as far. These guys have crossed the map range. I do not. So, you know, that's a thing. Now, the Sexton, I've told you guys before. You've probably seen it once or twice. It hasn't been featured for a long time, so maybe the newer people haven't seen it on my channel. So, uh, if you haven't seen it, the Sexton 1 is an M3 Lee that had the roof cut off and Focus a bigger gun location. mounted. And the bigger gun is a 25-pounder howitzer that is a British gun. Ready to fire. Pounder. fire but it's a beautiful little gun it's super accurate i'm having a hard time hitting these guys next to these buildings but it's really accurate it's not the fastest firing gun in the world but it, it's pretty pretty decent fire rate as you'll see it reloads fairly quickly there we track the m3 lee now he's sitting broadside on to a 25 pounder howitzer and I don't know what happened. That shot literally just disappeared. Reloaded. Um, he's still tracked, so I'm going to put this shot out there, and this time we get him 124. So, you know, he was essentially in the same tank I am, except he has a uh, normal armor-piercing weapon, and I have the 25-pounder howitzer. And like I said, this is this tank can be like Burt, only at Tier 3. Uh, it doesn't do quite the damage that Burt does, but, you know, Bird has a 105 millimeter howitzer, where this is only a 25 pounder, and I don't remember Enemy the size that you'll have to forgive me. Uh, but it's, you know, Reloading. for a tier three, it's got a pretty fire. decent fire rate, so it's not huge. But at the same time, if I remember correctly, you can get a uh, 17 pounder on like the uh, AT7 or AT8, one of those uh, mid-tier tank destroyers for the British line. So it's not exactly a small gun, but for artillery, it's pretty tiny. Uh, and here you're going to see me Little shoot at the gorilla. We didn't penetrate and I armor. hit him and did no damage. I was not the first Open shot. I was Little the second red. shot. Shot out on the guy running. And we splash him. And here's the bolt. Is he behind it? Gun. Nope. He was in front of it. God bless it. Well, well, you know, can't win them all. At least we hit him the first time. And, nope, not going to be able to hit the gorilla. Come on, anybody? Oh, hello, Matilda. Shot out. No good. Didn't go through. Shot out. Nope. <laughs> Are we ever going to hit anything? Shot out. There we go, 43 damage. Yeah, that's my number. That's my number right there. Shot out. Loaded and ready. Nice and job. eight damage. That's terrible. Shot out. And I don't know how I, how much I hit him for because he got shot at the exact same time after. Him. But we did everything we could do. So now I'm moving a little bit further forward. Light tank is spotted. Come on, where you at? Okay, I cannot hit you. Okay, Hardy, Tank Destroyer. Hello, Tank Destroyer. Panzerstoffel. And there's a good hit. Well H.E. versus a Panzerstoffel. Uh. And shot out on the Hardy. Oh, just a little ahead of him. Just a little ahead of him. A half a second, not even half a second, like just barely missed him. Now this little guy here, he's hiding just enough, and then he gets ammo racked. 
End of the game. Eight hits, two kills, not bad. Probably towards the top due to the fact that I am bottom tier. Uh, even though I didn't do really a whole lot of damage. 499, you know, that's not bad in a tier 3, but that's nothing compared to what I've done in this thing. So, on to the next match for our double feature. This one's on Mountain Pass, and this time I'm going to show you the special part of the Sexton 1 that not a lot of people tell you. Now, the Sexton 1 is a very good rapid-fire artillery, but I'm in a tier 3 match in a tier 3 tank that's in a tier 4 chassis. If that gives you any idea what I'm about to do, we are going full on tank destroyer. Let's do this. Anything ever, uh, you ever seen an arty just go full on front lines the entire match? Yeah, well, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to sneak in their back door and I'm going to hit them and hit them and hit them and hit them. They're going to come at me. I'm going to hit them some more. That's what's going to happen. You guys ready? Look at my team straight up, going straight across the middle. They're coming across the middle. I thought about it for a second, then I was like, dude, by the time I even try to get sights on, that dude's dead. So, I, yeah, there he is. He's dead already. So I'm going to go left, and I'm going to go straight across the bridge. Why? Because look at all these tanks that are spotted on my team. Surely everybody's going to not be paying attention to the bridge, right? Everybody just tunnel visions the guys coming straight across, and they forget about the guy that may be sneaking around the backside. And this is why it's called this, yeah, this shoot. stat padding, not so much. I'm not really doing this for the stats. I'm doing it for uh, the lulls, which is called seal clubbing. Now, here we go. Are we going to get spotted or are we going to get some nasty shots into folks? Oh, dear Lord. Where have you been my whole life? And... Ow. Oh, that's a miss. I'm still not detected. How? Nope, that's a miss. Thought you said this thing was accurate. Well, it is. But, you know, the game still doesn't like you sneaking up on the back side of these guys. So, right off the bat, I'm trying to be cheeky. Now, I can shoot over this. He can't. <laughs> is this not the meanest thing you've ever seen somebody do? He's not spotted. I take the shot. It bounce, or it hits the dirt. So he's obviously moved. I move up to get... Oh, hello, little light tank. Goodbye, little light You're tank. Totally yeah, you want to try that again? All right, back to the little fella. Come us. on, Valentine. And there yeah. it is. Sorry, buddy. Oh, look at this guy. Tier 3, backside to me. Completely not paying attention. And... Shot out. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Shot out. We nope. Their armor. Come on, baby. Come on, Cletus. Come on. And They're another kill. Down. That's our third kill of the game. So, now, on to artillery. Right? Where could that already be hiding? He's probably hiding straight up. Yep, there he is. You know, very original positioning on his part. I mean, he is a tier two, so maybe he's, he's new to Artie. Can't really blame him for that. He sees Artie go up there, so he goes up there. Now, here I should stop and get ready to start aiming at these guys because I could get some easy shots. Instead, I drive in and I'm firing on the move for that one shot that may hit out of 100. Come on, give it to me. Nope, it's not going to happen. So, I stop, I'm aiming in, and pop. We <laughs> so we end up with nine hits, four kills. In a tank destroyer artillery. Not bad. 488 damage. Second on the leaderboard to one guy because of reasons. But anyway, if you like what I'm doing, punch that like button. Leave a comment below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And as always, I will see you in the next video.